Hello, I am Somi Akeni and I'm trying to do this video because of um, my fans. They've been asking, I mean, I promised that I was going to do a video on uh, small machines that can make you a lot of money. There are several 24th century machines now that they are, the, those machines are made in the 24th century and they are cheap and they don't consume so much energy like some of the machines made back in the olden days and you can make a lot of money with them so i've been talking about those kind of machine um actually i promised that this would be a series so but let me just go on with this the first one i want to talk about is the machine that has to do with um, um, printing on socks it's called 9-in-1 combo machine 9-in-1 combo machine that machine you can print on the socks you can print on um, cap you can print on uh, you can print on mug you can print on nine things that you can print on such a beautiful machine and it's sold for like 64,000 or very cheap less than 100,000 and when you bring in that machine into Nigeria you can use it to print on a lot of stuff so all you need to do is look for a shipping company based in Nigeria and based in China and then tell them to bring in the machine for you through ocean shipping don't forget what I said ocean shipping Ocean shipping is the best bet for you, right? Now, I need you to understand very quickly that um, that machine can make you constant income. I leave Moshua local government alone in Lagos State has about 200 schools. Now, if you are going to take a contract from just five schools that has 20, 20 children, making 100 children, 100 children multiply by the number of socks you are going to be printing on every time. You are going to be making a lot of money. That's a lot. There's a lot of money you can make with that. I'm not, I'm not even calculating all the schools in Alimosho. I'm not calculating all the schools in Lagos State. I'm not calculating all the schools in Nigeria. I'm not calculating the one in the North. And that is just socks alone. You can also use the machine to print on tennis. You can also use the machine to print on mug. You can also use the machine to print on shirt. You can also use the machine to print nine different stuff. Less than 100,000. Your 2.5 kVA will take that machine. So, I mean, there are fantastic machines that have been developed in this 24th century that you need to take advantage of making money quickly with. So you might want to check out um, that machine. I'm going to drop the link below. I'm going to drop the link below. The second one I'm going to talk about is the um, tomato preservation um, cork jar bottle machine. There, there, is, there is a tomato preservation way that a lot of people in Nigeria don't know about. And uh, I'm going to drop a video on tomato preservation in this part under this link so you click on show more and you'll find it there now when you go to my 12 you can buy a basket of um a basket of um, tomatoes during the tomato season you can buy that for let's say let's say 300 for a basket but when it's off tomato season that same basket that sold for 300 is going to be selling for as much as 5,000 or even more. Now, if you know how to provide preservation, it's going to go a long way to help you. And, and for you to provide a preservation for tomato, it's quite easy. Just boil the water a little, put the tomato in, bring them out, put them into the jar, and then cover it. You know, put um, olive oil somewhere along the process. 
there is a particular machine that can help you to close the jar bottle properly. And then you put a label and you are selling that. So during the off season, when people need tomato, and you have bought a 300 naira for a basket, and you added that value to it in terms of preservation, you can actually move ahead to start selling. That's a lot of money. And so I'm going to drop the video of how to do the tomato preservation thing in the under the link, so you can watch that as well. And I'm also going to put the machine that you can use to provide the... Um, to close the jar bottle, I'm also going to drop it in this link. I mean, this is fantastic business opportunity that a lot of people are not looking at in Nigeria. In fact, you can also think of making tomato paste. I'm also going to drop the machine for making tomato paste in the link um, in the link below. There's a lot of opportunity for us as Nigerians. Nobody is doing that already. We can start with that idea. You might not understand what I'm saying properly. You just need to check the link and then you'll be able to see that and then, you know. Now, so what am I trying to say? What I'm trying to say is that there's these simple, simple machines that have been made in the 21st century that can make you a lot of money when you just buy them and begin to use them. As well about wafer, and smoothie slush machine there are some machines too that convert yogurt to ice cream now this is what i'm saying i i, I don't really mean convert to ice cream per se but i'm trying to say that this machine they will make the yogurt to look like ice cream you know when you are taking ice cream you put it on a cone and then you are licking the stuff enjoying yourself the same way you know, ice cream have a lot of sugar, but you got is LD. And so when you get this machine that is making world food for people and a machine that is making ice cream to, I mean, making you got to look like ice cream on a cone, fantastic. In fact, there's a machine that can also make the cone. All these machines are cheap and you need to look at them. Then there's another machine that uses gas and can make bread for bakers. You want to go into bread making, bakery, just think about that machine. You know, you get that machine. So I'm dropping the link of all those machines I mentioned below. And I want you to also check the other machines. I just dropped some other machines that are good, you know, that you can also take advantage of. In this video below just try and check them out I'm sure you're gonna find um, all those link very useful and so um, I'm just trying to see what I can do for my people till I come your way next time I'm something I can but I'm saying remain financially intelligent <laughs>